really curious to see what Garrett's going to go for. And he's carrying the Donkey Kong one set mm. into that. Yeah, I'm sure he wants to um, carry some of that momentum as well. Yeah. Already has the, uh, the uh, DK warmed up and ready to rev. Small battlefield. I'm pretty sure it's a great stage for DK, it's just battlefield, but... I, don't mm. know, I think, the, are the ceilings shorter than regular battlefields? I believe that is correct, yes. I will check the chat, because I'm sure if Thundaga is still here, she'll know. Facility absorbed, uh, flight of stability, it's, it's so funny seeing him dress up. <laughs> it's like earlier, except now he's grown hair all around the sides of his face. <laughs> Ceilings are not. Okay. But, um, I know... Flightless likes to take me to PS2 a lot when he was playing DK. Mm -hmm. So, this being the replacement to PS2 makes a lot of sense. I'm really curious if we're going to see a punch facility. I really want to see him play at one of these. I, um, I feel like this is one of those characters where, like I said, you can get true combos into that uh, neutral B after Kirby copies it. He just has to find the opportunity. Really scary for ability, just really difficult to land, but he gets the reverse edge guard a little bit. Gets back on stage. Good catch with the up tilt. Ability mm. played super pace mm. right there, he just waited. He knew that Flightless could have panic and do something. Yep. Just wait out an option and proceed accordingly. Oh, he goes for the upper. He gets that landing upper on the platform. That's really impressive combo. And it's still going 92 damage all from one opening. Yeah. <laughs> Crazy how. Uh, and he gets the stock off of it. That was a great uh, catch as well. It seems like Silly had a lot of success because Donkey Kong is so tall. He can just throw out a forward air and connect the grab right after. Yeah, he can get a lot of uh, versions off of that. You can see, he, yeah, I don't blame him, he should just keep going for fair here, it's probably a really great option. Yeah, Kirby just makes it back anyway. Oh, that almost landed. Facility is uh, definitely in a pretty good position right now. Oh, that, uh, that killing curse. <laughs> that killing is beneficial to Flightless, but I I, I still think um, Facility is. Oh, good that enough. trip! He could have just gone straight to first match at the end of the game. Yeah, that was offline yeah. probably. Yeah, not a bad react. Say the beat. Um, mm, oh, that much might have. That much range. Yeah, I. Who knows? These blast zones too. But now the KO punch is gone. So we'll use it. Oh my! Is no. gonna... Oh yeah. no! That's uh, that's what I was thinking about with this stage. This choice. If you get a solid enough opening, you can just go uh, off the top. The other day, um, I got a, I got a kill off a grab at 19% with Min Min. Like a back throw off stage? It was, um, yeah, back throw straight into forward smash and it just killed. Oof, yeah. I, that's how you kill Kirby at obscenely early percents, is you just get an open. It doesn't matter if it's the dragon or the fire, they both kill. <laughs> so it's still a really close game. I think he's definitely going to be counterpicking around the grab into up there. It's very unfortunate. Smashville, I think that kind of gives Donkey, doesn't, can't Donkey Kong still do the combo? I would think so, at least with the way the platform is right now. I'm surprised he didn't go for something like maybe FC or Kalos or even like Counter City. Mm -hmm.
I've gone, uh, I've gone for town quite a bit against Scylla in the past. The more uh, stage you have to run around, the Kirby can't catch you, the better. Yeah. Even though Scylla lost the first game, his uh, combat's been very impressive. Because mm -hmm. if he doesn't land them, it just becomes a whole lot rougher, so he has to capitalize on every other game. Yeah. That was, um... Just two cases where it looked like they were gonna die off the bottom and then just make it back. And they're both still on their first stop. KO punch and play. Probably gonna throw it out, I'd imagine. Oh, doesn't he get he's gonna map out time? He's not. And now Flightless has that to uh, use, just build percent really quickly if he finds an opportunity. Honestly, I feel like if uh, Sylvia had been closer, he might have done it coming back on stage there. Ooh. Oh, the board tilt in the wrong direction. I thought he was going to land on the wrong side. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. He does a lot of the... Uh, KO punch, or not KO punch, just the giant punch from above. Let's go back here. Oh, he's able to air dodge out of that. Yeah, a really good way to escape from what, uh, in most occasions would just be the DK death sentence. The Donkey Kong lose condition. <laughs> Falling there, able to put Sylvia off stage. Yeah, that Nair is uh, really good for positioning. Oh, that was a free, free giant punch, but uh, you didn't have enough time to react. And then burns it too quickly afterwards. Yeah, that positioning was, that was gonna happen. Yeah. If given the opportunity, <laughs> it was gonna happen. I, uh, yeah, I You go first. Oh, I was just gonna say that if Flightless can get him to like 60%, the grab will be very dangerous to watch out for. Absolutely. Just in general, uh, Sylvie's gotta be really cognizant of those. And I have to wonder as well, um, because Sylvie was not entering that many Wi Fi tournaments over the course of uh, summer. Flightless was entering quite a quite a good deal, so I have yeah. to wonder if um, familiarity with Wi-Fi and just in general being uh, the swing of playing a lot. So he's not wanting to get grabbed right now. Oh mm -hmm. my God, he DIs the attacker a little bit. Yeah, that's what I was uh, worried about too. Like at this percent. Yeah. 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 Oh, he survived. Ooh. That time. I thought it was going to be really tough to make the comeback though, just with the KO punch. And just yeah. all another backward real kill. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I just was all decked out to win that. Even if, um, Solidity had gotten a really good percent combo, if he hadn't killed right off of that, that would have just given DK even more rage. Mm -hmm. Even more opportunity. I wonder if Solidity can go for crazy down or stuff. stage. He might be able to get a gift of like 10. <laughs> so, I would, uh... I would just, uh, I guess, be worried if it misses that Sillity would capitalize instantly with his own down there. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you yeah, know, I was saying that. I think Sillity can just... Oh, oh I miss yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. My bad. Go! Like, both characters are very capable of getting crazy gifts. So, it's not anybody's game until so. I will say that Flightless um, mixes up his upbeat timings quite a bit. Uh, he lands on stage quite a bit. But if Cody can get to a type of rhythm, uh, that could be very, very useful for anticipating those upbeats and killing very early. Yeah. And for the selection, we saw. Oh my god, crazy yeah. jab block. Not gonna Almost cool. He's gonna go we up saw, there. We saw Sillian go right back into it. Same stage, same matchup. He was just ready to go. So we definitely think this is the stage to do it. 
Yeah, uh, I did see in Discord that uh, Flight was banned at the exact same stages as well, so... They're both, uh... They both are, uh, not, uh, too concerned about the stage, comparatively, I guess. Just, uh... Raw... Kirby versus DK. Flight was just holding shield, knowing Sylvie's not gonna let up. We haven't seen too many special moves from Sylvie. He hasn't gone for any, like, falling down keys or just, like, trying to get the KO play the, uh, the giant punch more than a couple times. <laughs> yeah. I guess, uh, Uppy is probably the one that has the most mileage. And there's very risky options since he misses, he can just die. Ooh, that looked like he was trying to shield the get up attack, but just, uh, just got, uh, beat out by it. Great job by a flight list faking that he was gonna go on stage and then just grab the ledge. Yeah. yeah he, he did really the same thing again! He did it again! He fixes the, those options up quite, quite well. It's, um, even with the character like DK, who's maybe the number one easiest character in this whole game to ledge trap. Like, uh, you can have a really hard time trying to ledge trap Flight vs. DK. It's not really easy at all. I feel like maybe, um, at least when I play him, Flight vs. greatest strength as a player is that he always feels like he knows exactly what you're going to do. Yeah. Or at least what option you're going for. And that extends beyond just, like, he knows you're fishing for low percent combos, but he knows, like, exactly which form of which option you're gonna pick. A lot of the time. We've seen over and over with these recoveries. The one time that he goes high, it works out perfectly. Oh, yeah. Oh my god, there's oh. no way. Okay. <laughs> it was so and scary. Right after. Yeah, that's, um... A lot of pressure. Pretty risky, but it did look like it came pretty close to hitting Kirby at least. Yeah. And that's another case where it looked like Sillity was trying to shield, but just uh, DK's get up attack is too powerful. Yeah. Yeah. Any of these ledge guards or edge guards, they just go a little bit differently. I think the set is really different. Yeah. Good catch with the back, yeah. Is that it? Oh, oh, oh my. Just really wow. Or the most yeah. quick time to get it, too. That was a sick combo by Flightless. I think it was like a landing aerial to death attack at the dunk. <laughs>